Alright, so hello and welcome back to Brave New World Blindfolded. This time I'll be going into Mount Colts, which is sort of the first dungeon with any sort of meat to it. Uh, a lot of enemies here have counterattacks, and from the comments on Insane Difficulty, I thought most of them would be counterattacking fi the fight command, but that doesn't actually seem to be the case. Uh, the only enemy that I found that counterattacks the fight command is the one that uh, is uses a poison attack and so I can just guard against it with the star pendant and it'll miss. Either that or Locky just got uh, five evades in a row or so when I was testing it. Which is always a possibility as evade is pretty high. If you're wondering why I exit out of the menu every single time, it's just to be careful. I'm not... like, when I'm going backwards, I'm not 100% sure all the time how the menu is exiting out, so... Alright, uh, I'm not 100% sure I got what I wanted there, but... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5... Huh, I messed that up? Dang it. Okay, it's Grease Monks, I probably don't want to... Alright, this is kind of a mess. Okay, good, I made it to Savin's Cabin. And considering I was going left and right, I mean left and up, uh, there's no way I could have come in from any side other than the bottom. So that's good too. <laughs> All 
Alright, so let's hope I equip myself properly. Alright, so... Uh, so... Alright, so I had a bit of a mind equals blown moment. I just realized that instead of putting the blanket over top of my head and having to sit in a stuffy blanket all of like half an hour, I can just put the blanket over the laptop, so that's what I'm doing now. One, two, three, four, five. Walk all the way right, and straight up into Mount Colts. All the way up, one of these, two of these, three of these. One, two, three, four. Alright, I'll wait for them to attack. I I want to use Terra's turn properly before... Oh wow, it's a preemptive again, isn't it? Okay, so that means that's a... That means it's a battle with two Vaporites and a Brawler, so I'm going to use the Auto Crossbow. I don't want to use Fire in this battle. Well, first of all, to conserve MP, but also because... Oh, whoops, I had a gar attack. That was dumb. Uh, but I also don't want to use it because these guys give counter attacks, so. Okay, good, that is Terra. Alright, so Edgar's now set to auto crossbow like he should be, instead of just randomly wailing on everything. There we go. Alright, so I'm still walking up the staircase. I took a little bit of damage from that battle, but probably not enough to be worrisome. All the way up to the top, to the right, down, to the right, all the way down, and out the door. Now I can go to the right and hit this little piece of rock. Take one step into the door. Now I walk down to go around this rock. I should be out. I mean, uh, indoors at this point. Still going down. Okay, these are tuskers. So I want to noise blaster them. I don't want to auto crossbow the tuskers because. They counter the auto crossbow, so so I've got to be wary of the counters of both the Tuskers and the Brawlers. Thankfully, Noise Blaster is a sure fire hit either way. So, dang it, Lucky didn't kill it. Usually he does. I think the shield block was on my side, which means that, like, I can tell from the stereo sound. So. That means the blizzard must have hit them. So I'll just wait for this guy to launch an attack. <laughs> Any time now. There we go. Terra's mostly just in the way unless she's casting a fire spell. So I just have her defend so that she's less likely to die. Alright, there we go. Still going down. Don't want to forget. It's way too easy to let that happen. 
Now under the rock. Up one, right a bunch. Up one, right a bunch. Down. Left. Up. There we go. Chest. Okay. So, I'm on item. Skills equip. Equip lock. So I selected lock. Choose equip. Down to this, which I equip. Alright, so now I'm out, but first I want to go up to item, before I forget where my cursor is, because I messed up equipping the power glove last time. Lock, Terra, who doesn't need it, and Edgar, who also doesn't need it, but the cursor's on Edgar, so that's what I want. Or at least it should be on Edgar. Back into the cave. The fact that Lock took all those hits surprises me. Because usually he's the one who uh, would be evading them all, but... If he took that many hits, though, I'm going upwards, then he'd probably have actually taken some serious damage, though, so I'm glad I healed him. So, Lark should kill this one, so I don't have to worry about it hitting me. Dang, he didn't. He had to prove me wrong. Oh, the other one killed it for me. <laughs> so I didn't get hit anyway. Or maybe not. Okay. I think I've taken a few hits quite a few hits this battle, so... It's probably dead, I think. Hang on. Am I where I think I am? I might actually not be. That didn't seem like a double Tusker battle. Seemed off a little bit. I'm starting to think. If I'm still outside... I'm not sure. I'll keep going and see if I get into more battles. Left. Down here. Up. Right. Get up here. Yeah, I'm really starting to get a bad feeling about this. I got a battle going up. Interesting. Okay, so I don't want to use a noise blaster on them. I'm definitely in the cave right now, which means I'm one in one of two places, in the place I was originally supposed to be, or the other likely place is uh, just next to the entrance of where I was coming back in from getting the chest. I may be there and walking up along the original route. Interestingly enough though, I don't think it'll matter what route, what path I take, as long as I uh, as long as I take the same path for either case, I should end up being able to figure it out and not deviate from where I'm supposed to go. Alright. 
so the tra screen transition theoretically just happened. One, two, three. Yeah, I thought so. So let's hope I didn't just somehow manage to slide in that one narrow spot I'm a little worried about. Straight up. Oh, I'm starting to get worried that I'm not getting a battle here either. Okay, that might be a good thing. Alright, I'm already on the auto crossbow. Good work, Terra. Rat's luck missed. I'm worried he may have been blinded. In that case, I'll have to use a remedy. It's also possible that the enemy just randomly evaded it, though, which would be better. I'll see if he keeps uh, missing. Last time he, he started missing a lot, and I was wondering what was going on, and I didn't think of that for some reason. One, two, three. Yes, good, my second guess was correct. Okay, back on track. So I'm on items right now. One, two, three. Relic. And I moved the cursor back to Edgar earlier, so I should be on Edgar. Last time I equipped Locke with the power glove and took his sprint shoes off, which was definitely a bad thing. Well, not definitely a bad thing for him, but it just wasn't nearly as good as equipping the power glove on Edgar in place of nothing. I may also want to heal now. Equip, skills, item. Dried meat. Heal, heal, heal. Okay. Let's start moving again. Left. All the way down. All the way right, out the secret thing. Down the bridge. That's Edgar. That's Terra. I'm probably gonna have to start conserving her MP a little bit more if I want to make it to the save point. And be a little bit safer in some of the battles coming up. Which are gonna be harder. The Condor is the hardest enemy in uh, Mount Colts right now. Uh, basically, it uses Gale Cut sometimes and can also blind block, which I also really don't want, so it's just nasty all around. Yeah, this is a waste of my Noise Blaster, but whatever. I guess it doesn't really matter because it's dead. But. The Vaporites also have Blaze, but they always die before they can use it, I'm pretty sure, so. There's no chance of it actually making a difference. Alright, now I've got to make sure to go only one step up and left at a time here. But I can go as far as I want. So I can just take a few extra to be safe. Alright, one, two, three, four. I'm on the fourth one this time. crossbow their faces. Unfortunately, I already told Locke to attack before they slowed to me, so... Oh, 
Okay, it didn't take nine years for Locke to get a turn, so I'm thinking I equip I didn't equip the Power Glove on Locke this time. I mean, I may have equipped it on Terra, probably not. Five, six, seven, eight. Okay, now hopefully I'm going upwards now. Hopefully I'm going left. Back up. Out the door. Okay, good. I would be certainly running into a wall there if I wasn't on the bridge. Tara, go back to sitting there. Now that I think about it, how could Locke possibly have been blinded? He, I never heard any of those uh, moves of Vaporize used earlier to do the blind status, so... Do I really want to heal? I took a couple hits. I don't think I need to. Left. And out the door. Which isn't really a door, it's more like just a cliff entrance, but whatever, it's easier to say door. All the way up. All the way right, and back out this cliff side. Now I go down. One left, one down. One left, one down. All the way to the right. Uh oh, where are the fights? Back one. Up. Well, this should be on the cliff side. Well, that's a condor, that's for sure. So I'm on auto crossbow already. When Locke gets his turn back, I'll hit the Condor. I want that thing dead. Yeah, Edgar has to take a beating to use the auto crossbow there, but... Oh, nifty. Couple things died. The last one was probably the Tusker, but I'm not 100% certain. Oh no wait, Locke hit the Tusker already, so no, probably not. It would be the Trillium. Well, they're all still alive, so that's a good sign. Straight up. Now I've entered the cave, back down. To the right. Now it should be a cave battle. You know, I'll just save her MP here. The Tuskers don't usually do too much damage by themselves. So... I'm gonna have to take the time hit here. Alright, you get out of the way, Terra. Alright, that's one down. And the other one used Blizzard, so it's not off Confuse.
this is kind of a pain in the butt. I not sure if I should really bother playing it this conservatively, but whatever. I'll wait for Locke to get another turn. Meanwhile, I'll get Terra out of the way. And make sure that it's Terra that's out of the way and not getting rid of the king for me. That would be a pain. Okay. But it's better to get a Tusker fight than a fight outdoors. Those are a lot more dangerous. All the way down. And out the door. One, two. There we go. I got a tincture. It's not much, but it'll help. All the way left. To the right here. And now I can just backtrack the way I came. One left. Alright, now I should be out of the cave. One down, two down, all the way to the left. All the way up. Now I gotta wait for a couple screen transitions to go here just in case. Now, right. Now I go back in the cave. One step down, two steps down. And battle, apparently. That's another Tusker fight. Fire will make this go a whole lot faster, but this could be one of my last charges, I think. Yeah, whatever, I'll do it. That's hardly necessary, probably, I think, but might as well. Yeah, didn't do anything. <laughs> Figured as much, but... Alright, right across the wooden bridge. So now I hit this little patch of the wall. Back one to line myself up up here all the way right to the end of here around the twisty bit dang it not again this time I'm not gonna use the spell Okay, so the first one must have used a uh, gore on one of the Tuskers because I parried the other attack. And the first one had to be confused still. I'll just keep attacking this one, it's pretty much dead. Fighting the Tuskers is a little bit more worrisome when there's only one left, because if there's only one left it will play a little bit smarter and use Blizzard.
Alright, let's get Terra out of the way again. I'll try to time it. Yeah, there we go. And now this one should hit itself and... Well, actually, I think it's dead after this attack, right? Well, it doesn't matter, it just hit itself. Oh, crud. I just used something. Thank goodness for lock speed. If that was a fire spell, that would be such a waste after I didn't use it for what would actually be useful for. Alright, so all the way to the right. Now let's heal up before going outside to what I think is outside, because this is the part where I'm probably most likely to die. And it's right next to the end, so I really don't want to die here. Out the door. All the way to the right. Now I start inching my way up to the top. Nice. Do I auto cross with their face? Okay, these are. This is probably a double trillion battle. Oh well, let's burn it. This is what I'm saving the fire spells for anyway. This area. Now that I think about it, that really was a waste. Unless there's not the battle that I'm thinking of. Oh well, I'm not complaining, I don't think. Further up? I don't think I took any hits, did I? I just kind of parried a bunch of stuff. Now, straight right across the bridge. Yeah, that was only to be expected. Well, I've still got a fire spell left. So I think I've made it in terms of fire spells. If that was the last one, I did a good job of conserving my MP. If otherwise, I was just wasting time. There we go. Everything's dead. Alright, let's finish running to the right. Alright, did I finally make it? One up, one down, one, two, three, there we go, got it, finally, I can take the blindfold off my computer, and save, I ended up level 8, that'll be helpful, <laughs> the extra levels will be helpful. And stop. Down. Right. Down. It's trying to get weird there. Okay. Alright, so first order of business is Terminus is Agar Terra. It's Agar. I'll wait till they attack. Okay. It's Tusker, so I gotta use a noise blaster. And I'll burn them once. This one should die from Locke's attack here, so I don't need to worry about unconfusing it. Or not. Didn't I already hit it once and then with the fire? I can't use auto crossbow against these guys because they counterattack that. So this is Edgar, so the next person who comes up should be Terra. If it's. Yeah, it's Terra, so let's just have her defend. I don't really need to do anything. I'll let that one attack itself and then I'll have Lock uh, go. That took slightly longer than expected. I don't really need that. I'm just gonna hit it again. This should be Terra, let's defend. There we go. Alright, first battle out of the way. Hopefully I didn't take too much damage. I mean, it really doesn't matter how much damage I took it away because, uh... Okay, now where was I? Was I going right for the, set, for the last time, or...? I 
think it's so easy to test this. If I'm running at the door here, it's probably a fail. One right, one down. If I'm running at the door there, it's probably a success. Uh-oh, uh, I'm not getting any encounters. So I probably ran at the door in the wrong spot. Is there any way to salvage this? I don't know. One, two, three, four, five. All right, I'm hoping maybe I went to the door there. I mean, it's my only real shot. I don't really know the dimensions of that area, so I can't say for sure. Straight down. Well, I got a battle there. That's a good sign, maybe. Now you're dead. Okay. I know where I am this time. Well, presuming I knew where I was before the fight, which isn't entirely likely, so... Essentially, I bothered to memorize where I thought I was, but I might not actually be there. So if I'm running into a ca the cave right now, it's a good sign. And I'm not getting a chest here, so it's not a good sign. Okay, that's fine. Alright, so I'm on Relic right now. Go into the menu. Three up. Items. You don't need it. Yay. You two needed it, though. Oh, well, I got one dried beat in the deal there. So, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, now I should be lined up at the bridge. First bend. And the second bend. Now, hopefully I'm on the mountainside. If I could get a nice battle to confirm that, it would be very handy. Uh-oh, starting to get worried. One, two... Yeah, I'm starting to get really, really worried now. There's no way I made it all that distance without a battle. One, two... Dude, crud, there's no way a Trillium would die in one hit from that. I don't think there's any Serpius. I mean, Serpii in the... that area. Yeah, I think I'm stuck. But I'd better just make sure. I'll wait till one of them attacks. Punch and the... Uh, what was that second one? Oh yeah, it was probably... Yeah, punched by the... Okay, yeah. Forget it. My next solid audio cue is the safe point, so... Gotta make sure I run up through both screen transitions here. And now I can run straight to the right. In some ways I like not having a battle, but in some ways it scares me. Uh oh. I'm starting to get an idea of what I made messed up. Cross the bridge. One step up. Cross the bridge some more. Yeah, there's no way. There's no way I haven't gotten a battle since then. So here's the painful part, trying to figure out where I messed it up. Exactly where I messed it up. Alright, so I think I might be on the cliff side here. I think I might work my way up here. Now go up this way. Alright, with some luck I may have gone around the cliff again. Right. Down. One. Two. All the way left. Back one. Up. Alright, so if it's Tuskers, I'm probably in that little cave area. Oh no, I, warming my way up like that isn't a good idea. I, I may have ended up in that little slot, and I may have also ended up in... Okay, one, two steps down, two steps to the right. And I'm hoping there's just several spots in that room where this would guide me back up this, to this little door. Out the door. Actually, I probably didn't need to do that, but... Back in the door, what I'm hoping I'm doing. To the right. Straight up. Left. Up. Now hopefully I'm walking back out the front door here. One, two. Alright, what is this? the mountain. Seems like I've exited that little cave, so that's a good sign for sure. So I'm going left. This lines me up at the doorway, so I go up. I have to wait a while to make sure the screen transitions go. Now I take one step right, ten to the cave. Two down. All the way over here. Oh man, no battles for a while again. It's starting to get weird again. Oh no, there definitely should have been a battle by now.
Ja, es ist Sankt. 